Foot on it. Dad, it's soupy. Good morning, guys. Happy Monday. That's at least the day we're filming this. Connor just said water. I got Eli and Brennan with me, and we are currently out in Ottawa, Iowa, getting ready to start one of our first construction projects this season. So behind me, we got stuff painted out for our 20 by 25 uh, recreational swim pond. We got an intake bay going into this, and we got a wetland going into this. It's going to be a pretty fun deal. So we're building this feature out here because the homeowners have some awesome koi fish that they keep in their basement and tubs right now, and they want to give it a little bit bigger of a home. So we're going to build this feature it's gonna be a fun time we're gonna get going after it we got a couple days or probably about a week and a half two weeks out here to do this first things first we're gonna put a tile line underneath this whole system in case there's any water buildup then we're gonna start digging our pond today pretty good so we have the shape of our intake bay dug tying into the shape of our pond it's currently a bit circular but we're gonna get that fucked up with the rock work and we left ourselves an excessive amount of liner to where we can bump it out in different areas where need be we got to pop it out a little bit there for our bottom pump vault and then we're working our way up so we got our waterfalls and stuff that'll go in here up into our wetland doing stones here but yeah we got a lot of stuff to do first tomorrow we're currently getting our liner unloaded and then we're going to get that stretched out because there's a chance of thunderstorms tonight but tomorrow when we get in here we will work on digging our intake bay vault and also working on digging the rest of our pond so then we can get everything linered and fabric and good to go to get rocking in morning guys day two we got about half an inch of rain out here in a tunnel last night so we are going to drain down the water that got captured inside the liner we laid out to make sure we could keep our site about as dry as we could be.
Alright, and after we get that excavation done, we're going to shape out our shells, make sure everything's perfect for us, throw our fabric and liner in, and start throwing some rocks. Buddy, day three out here in Atunwa. We got our pond pretty much all the way dug. We want to get some liner put in. Talking yesterday, we were going to make a few changes. We're actually going to add a sec another pump into our intake bay to get us a little bit more flow. That being said, we got to go ahead and adjust the size of this. So we're going to blow this out a little bit, dig our blocks in, get our blocks all set up in here. Lots going on. The boys are going to get all of our rock load brought back from yesterday. Alright guys, little update. We have our blocks and everything test fit in our basin. The only thing we still have to do is dig our vaults down, but we're pretty comfortable with the way everything sits in here that once we get those blocks or those vaults dug down, should be good to go. That being said, our excavation is then going to be complete for the pond and the intake bay. Next thing's next. We're going to get some fabric cut off, lay all of our fabric down in our hole. We got our liner folded up. We'll get that strapped up. Set it right there on that white tee. Unfold everything. Should be pretty good to go. We got our second load of rocks over there. Our first load has all been brought to the backyard so far. And we're just chipping away. Alrighty guys, we are approaching the halfway point here in Atunwa. We've had a lot of stuff completed already, but yet we still have quite a bit of stuff to take care of and get finished up. That being said, we're going to make you wait to the next video to really see how this one turns out with final products and everything like that. So make sure you stay tuned for part two of this video coming out here probably next week. 
Um, if you like what you're seeing so far, though, leave a comment down below and let us know what you're most excited to see with the finished part of this feature. And then also, if you want to do something a little bit more and stay updated with everything, make sure you click that subscribe button. Click that bell icon so you get updated when we post, so then you can't miss the grand finale of this video. Thanks for tuning in, guys. We'll catch you later.